Well, good morning, everybody. This is your frugal granny. And, uh, new episode going on in my life right now. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Ring the bell. Share me out. Leave notifications down below. Notifications? See, that shows I'm a granny. I can't think straight sometimes. Um, leave a comment below. That's what I meant to say. Today is not a good day for Granny. I'm going to try to make it a good day. Um, for those of you that have been following my channel, you know that I am a dumpster diver. Um, Regan. Um, and most recently, DoorDash delivery. Yeah. Um, just some random feelings coming across today, guys. I hope you can kind of bear with me. I need to get some things off my chest. Um, those of you that have been following my channel for the last year or so, or last few months, um, I had to move out of a place that I was living in November of last year and uh, my late brother-in-law and late sister had an estate that is under probate but it's coming out now but anyway uh, my cousin is the owner of the estate she agreed to let me buy it from her not go through a bank just pay her monthly payments um, now that it's coming out of probate, she has changed her mind and is selling it to someone else for more money than I could give her. Um, actually, she's selling it to a realty company who told her, I have cash in hand. So, where does that leave for a good granny and um, 11-year-old granddaughter? Uh, we looked and looked and looked for another place to move to. And everything is so expensive, I can't afford it again. So for the last three years, every time I found a place to move to, I've ended up having to move out. Um, I think probably the only land I'm really going to own is probably the six foot they put me in when it comes my time to pass. But anyway, that's a little bit grotesque to think about. But it's life. Um, I can't afford to pay rent, pay for car payments. Relocating again and again and again has broke me literally broke me um so that's why i'm door dashing i am on disability but for those of you that don't know this you can get a ticket to work through social security and let me turn this car off guys it's bugging the daylights out of me but it's hot out here had to run my air conditioning in the car. Anyway, uh, yeah, a ticket to work. You get that from Social Security. And for a two-year frame period, you can actually try to work. And um, you'll get your Social Security check once a month plus your paycheck. Then at the end of two years, they will reevaluate you, and if they see that you are able to work, you stop getting Social Security, and then you're out in the workforce again. So that's the situation I'm in now. Um, I'm trying to work because I thought I was going to be buying this house. Now I'm not. My niece, to niece slash cousin, whatever you want to call it. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Yeah, she's um, given me about 90 days to move out. So, 
um, my ex and I were talking, and since we do co-parent the 11-year-old, he's the only dad she's ever known anyway, and even though he's grandpa, um, yeah, just bear with me, guys. It's all I can do not to cry. Um, he has agreed, actually it was his, his idea, he is, um, going to let us move into his home because he's planning on retiring and, um, he wants to live the camper life. So he said, well, you know, I've got to rent it out to someone. I would rather you and the baby girl be in there. So that's what we're going to do. But this time we're going to have have it on paper instead of just me moving back home and then us getting into an argument six months later and me being told to leave. I'm not going to go that route again. But anyway, that's what's going on with me in my life. Um, as far as dumpster diving goes, I've had to kind of put that on hold a little bit because, like Ms. Fugel really just said, I had to go back trying to work. Um, I just knew for sure that I was going to be getting this house. And, um, I sold my car that was 23 years old. And I bought this one. It's a, uh, 2011 Chevrolet HHR four-cylinder. Five, five-speed transmission, but it's automatic transmission. Fully loaded. Tilt wheel, cruise control trip meters, the whole thing, um, OnStar, I got, um, 60 days free OnStar with the car, AM, FM, radio, CD player, it, it's nice, I like it, um, but I'm making payments on that too, and like I said, I am door dashing, I like door dashing. It's, um, it's paying me off pretty well. Instead of making videos like I was going to make about my door dash episodes, um, I was going to show you daily what I was doing on a daily basis as far as my deliveries and the amount of money I was making daily. But I've decided to make um, a weekly video and show you how much I make a week. And I've been doing this now for a month. And um, one of the other YouTubers that I watch a lot is uh, Diving With Purpose. Um, her name is Cynthia. She's also a dumpster diver. And um, she started door dashing about, about the same time I did. But she's already putting her videos up on her. So guys, go ahead and check her out. Um, I just haven't had a chance to do it, and I've got a, a wedding coming up for my oldest granddaughter, so we've been traveling back and forth from Alabama to uh, central Georgia, getting dresses, being fitted, and going through 11-year-old tantrums that don't want to wear a dress right now. So, yeah, it has been pretty, pretty hectic, and guys... To tell you, you ladies and gentlemen, the truth, I don't remember when is the last time I actually had a day just to myself so I could go and have some fun. Just some fun. I mean, you know, just go fishing or anything. I just haven't had any fun in a while. All I do is worry about everything. Where to live. I don't own a stick of furniture to my name. Oh, yeah, I do. I own two. I own two. I own an office chair and a solid oak 55-gallon aquarium stand. I own my dishes. I own all my clothes. On a laptop, a desktop, electronic stuff, you know, phones, cameras. And that's about it. Oh, two coffee pots, two crop pots. 
some pots and pans. So I can't say since I own pots and pans, I can't say I literally don't have a pot to whiz in and a window to throw it out of. But that's about it. So that was another reason um, I can't afford to go out and rent any place is because I have no furniture. I have no home furnishings to put in a place. So, I hate feeling this depressed, but I just wanted to um, share with you guys what's going on with me in case y'all thinking, well, Frugal Granny's not putting videos up anymore. Yes, I am. I'll be putting up videos. It's just not about dumpster diving. It's going to be about some of my everyday life, um, what goes on in my life. The, the struggles that I have, the accomplishments that I have, and yes, I talk with my hands. So, um, it's just life. My channel is not only about dumpster diving, it's about life. And sometimes it sucks, and other times it's you're standing on the mountain, and other times you're down in that valley. And right now, I'm down in a valley. Well, guys, I'm going to have to um, get off of here for a little while, little while because um, I'm going to cry a little bit. And uh, I don't want anyone to see me cry. To me, that's, um, that's just not an easy thing for me to talk about. I was in a... Um, relationship years and years and years ago when I was married to someone then and any time I was depressed or cried he would hold his hands up to my face and say cry me a river cry me a river but um that's past and um I need to quit dwelling on the past so I have to um just tell you all that I do love all of my subscribers. I don't think of you as just subscribers. I think of you as friends. And um, I appreciate y'all hanging in there with me and watching my videos and leaving comments and sharing with others. And please ask other people to um, watch my videos. I, I need all of that I can get. I've lost a lot of subscribers, a lot of friends there. And... I've lost a lot of watch time hours, and um, I need all the help I can get. I'm not asking for money, donations, or anything, even though I do have a donation button on my channel. You don't have to donate. Just, just pray. Be a friend. God bless you. Love you guys. Frugal Granny out for now.